Hey, what's up, you guys? So it's uh, another video with Kara and me. If you haven't checked out our vlog before this video, I hope you did. We went to the mall. We had an adventure. We had fun. We splurged on our money because we both have jobs and we love to. That's what teenagers do. Kara, you store. Okay, so we went to Bath and Body Works, right? Let's see. And I got this black cherry Merlot nourishing. It's Merlot. And and cream, and it smells like cherries. Cherries for Sermia. Ooh, we got lotion in our nose. Be Joyful Shea and Vitamin E Shower Gel. You know some people on YouTube pronounce it Shea. Here's some Shea butter, I'm like... <laughs> it's Shea, by the way. Stop. This other lotion, Warm Vanilla Sugar. Shea and Vitamin E Body Lotion. It smells good, too. Sounds like my dick. So, one I got from Bath and Bonnie once you was. My face. <laughs> <laughs> so, I got another shower gel because my stank ass. I finished my other shower gel at home. It's a thousand wishes. And uh, I, this time I got Paris because Carol's like, get Paris to smell good. <laughs> and I was like, okay. It does smell good. And you trusted me. Ooh, Ooh a bubble. <laughs> Oh yeah, but it smells good, delicious. She said it smells clean and um... Clean and fruity at the same time. Fruity, yeah. And then, I saw this little container holder thing. It, it was right on a perfume. It was a vanilla perfume that she has, it was on it. And I was like, oh. She's like, first she saw it, she said, oh, look. And I was like, oh. So I just literally snatched it from the bottle and I fucking took it and I was like, this is mine now. <laughs> Can you... <laughs> Can you believe this has its own price though? This separately was ten dollars, and then the bottle itself is like twelve. So, twenty-two dollars for both. It was actually fourteen. I don't remember the price. I do. <laughs> but yes, now I can use it for any bottle I want. I can just put it in there when I finish the bottle. Just bottle, I can keep this. And Kara suggested I could use it for other things. Yeah, like bubble gum and like decorations, because his. His little area in the house is very boring, and by boring I mean he's just decorated by his necklaces. So this is to add to those necklaces that decorate his basement. I can also put a, deco uh, dic uh, a dildo in here to make it decorated. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna buy one of those dick bouquets from uh, Spencer's and put it in here. That actually be a really good decoration. My mom will question it, but I don't care. So, okay, so we went to Charlotte Roos as well. And I got this really big 3XL t-shirt to wear with this shirt that I bought the other day that was like $20. Just let's not talk about it. It's really nice though, because it's like silky. It's like a silky color. It looks like it's shiny in the light. But right now it's kind of dull. It's literally work clothes colors. We're gonna have another adventure tomorrow where we go downtown to the city yeah. and she'll be wearing it. So. You'll see my you'll see my coworkers probably. <laughs> yeah, that and her outfit of the day. Yeah, I should try this on with that shirt by the way, eventually. And I also got a bunch of underwear. You don't need to see them in, in person in depth and you know, explain. But you understand, I got underwear for twenty-four dollars for ten of them. That's actually not a bad deal. No, it's not a bad deal at all. Cause you can buy like four boxers for like what? Also like fifteen. A pack of four from Walmart for like ten. Yeah. That's not that's not good on a rip though. It's a rip It's that cheesy shitty one where if you fart, you gotta rip a hole in it. Yeah, like if you have like actual boxers, they're just like the non-stretch kind, and it's like really uncomfortable. Yeah. And they give you uh, what do they call track marks or what do they call? Them? I don't know. I've never boxers before. Mm -hmm. girl. So then we went to uh, Charlotte Roos. My favorite place to go for necklaces because and jewelry because they're they have good deals. They have like two for ten uh, necklaces and other stuff like that. Um, oh, they're tangled. Okay, so here's the first one. That's what it looks like. Hopefully you can see. And then this is the second one. This um, one's more you for sure. Yeah, this one's more me. It's gonna fit. It's kind of crooked on the thing because you know they don't fix it. You just made it worse. <laughs> <laughs> there. But yeah, those are cute. Black. Just to show how exaggeratedly small it is. Oh no, it looks good actually. Yeah, no, well, it is a choker. You should get like a V neck with it. That'd be really. I cool. have a V neck. Yeah, like a like a white one or something. I feel like the princess of the Sahara, like uh, be me, my sand slaves, like fucking sand people. It looks good. Look at it in the mirror. Uh. 
I love it. Yeah, it looks good. And it's black. I usually wear black in my outfit, so this is what it looks like up close if it's not too zoomed in. Mm -hmm. looks like. Nice, right? But I also love that when I walk around all like nice and sassy, all you're gonna hear is Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell, rock. <laughs> Keep singing. I don't know the whole thing. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, you're weird. Okay. Uh, Kara, you wanna show them your tattoo real quick now that we're done with our haul? So. Here's Kara's arm tattoo. My legs are over here as well. <laughs> and this one, she was inspired by a drawing that she made back in. Tell them the story. Okay, so I, I was in ceramics class. And I was trying to draw an alien, but I messed up. So I drew a body on it and I colored it in. And that's that. That's how this happened to be her new foot tattoo. That's cool. I don't. I think you showed this on prom night, but I don't think you did show it. I showed that. No, I showed that one. Remember when we were at my. Uh, you were at my work? Oh yeah. Huh? You were at my work and you were talking about crop dusting stories and then that's what when oh, that happened. Yeah. <laughs> that's when that happened. So that's when Mike and I both had new tattoos, huh? Yeah. Both of you were like, look at my tattoo and I was like, okay. That's what people do. Actually I don't show this one off like at all though. Because you can't really see it. You have to wear flip flops. I don't even so. talk about it either. Just something you have. Yeah. Leave a like if you enjoyed this episode or video. Subscribe today if you haven't already. I'll see you in the next video that I create. This was Kara, thank you for being here. I know who I am. And so, goodbye, elites. Goodbye.